Now, you were uh, Houston's leading scorer, as I said in the lead in. Uh, so coming to Jackson State and, and, and taking fewer shots, because uh, uh, anybody that watched the game know we were dedicated to trying to get Misha her touches, and y'all mm -hmm. were so uh, talented across the board that, you know, pretty much everybody out there could go get a bucket, you know what I'm talking about? So mm -hmm. uh, how was it for you being able to uh, fit into that scheme like that? So even though I'm not the leading scorer here, I still do, you know, different things. Like my role hasn't changed from from when I was at Houston to where I am now. See, at Houston, I was more – so I had to score. You get know what I'm mm -hmm. trying to say? So I absolutely had to score. Here, I don't have to do much. And, you know, it was, it was a little adjustment for me at first coming in because, you know, you got Misha, basically Misha team, Misha and Roger team, if we're going to be honest. Right. So, you know, I had to, you know, adjust to that. But I, I enjoyed playing with Misha. Though. That was that was a great experience to play with another – with a bit with a with a good big man, you know. So mm -hmm. yeah, it wasn't that big of an adjustment. I still had the same role. If anything, Coach Reed used to get mad when I didn't take that many shots. Really? So, yeah. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, Coach Reed. <laughs> Coach Reed used to get on my head in practice. I'll probably pass up a shot. She'll stop the whole practice. That yeah, let me not even want to <laughs> open too, Coach, you know. <sighs> She wanted you to be aggressive, though. She probably knew she was going to need that up out of you at some point. And, yeah. you know, it showed up. 